Mayans MCs. Last season is getting ready for this lamentable consummation. Assuming there is one thing that we have gained from Mayans MC furthermore, children of insurgency, it is that cheerful endings are just an unrealistic fantasy. As a result, what we're seeing with Angel, Clayton Cardenas, is starting to look too good to be true. Evidently, Holy Messenger's tone has changed since the first few episodes of the last season due to becoming a father for the first time. His perspective on life and humanity has changed as a result of having someone to care for him and inspire him. He had a touching conversation about moving on with this life with Bishop Michael Irby in the third episode of the season. However, Angel and all of us who want him to succeed in his new life face serious dangers as a result of this conversation. It's conceivable that what Heavenly Messenger is going through is Mayan's MC setting us up for something sad as we travel through this last section. Angel wants something that might not come true being a club member is not as straightforward as putting on a jacket and leaving life. When you sign up, you pretty much make the commitment. The show cleverly shows us what it would be like for someone to leave the club, even though Angel is still uncertain. At the finish of season 4, Marcus Alvarez, Emilio Rivera, was removed from his situation as president, and in season 5, we see him totally eliminated from the club. Ironically, he lives fairly comfortably at home with his wife and two children. However, in contrast to Angel, he was unable to leave. As a result, we are witnessing his struggle to completely disengage from his previous existence and the possibility that he will be dragged back into that world as the ongoing conflict between